Hello, it's Rob Nagy from Jeru Tree and Lawn Care. Today I just wanted to show you a few things. I'm at a client's property. I'm going to do a pH reading uh, with this pH meter. It's a pretty simple device that what we do is stick it into the ground here. And what's going to happen is it's going to give me a reading in about a minute of what the soil pH is. pH levels in, you know, in lawn is very important. I don't want to get overly scientific with you in regards to what uh, pH is. But the bottom line is the average is around 7. Anywhere between 6.5 into 7 is usually acceptable. Anything lower, we want to increase the acidity by doing some lime treatments. Again, changing that soil profile. Everything underneath this grass here, uh, it's important to make sure it's healthy. On the high range, if it's over 7, uh, we have an, an alkaline soil. And again, we're going to have to do some soil amending. Most of the time, we're putting sulfur down in that case to try to increase um, you know, the, the acidity and, and get it more even there. As far as what I see here on this reading, I'm looking right now at a reading that is approximately 6.2. So what that is showing me is in this situation, in this back area, we have to do an adjustment. Uh, I'm gonna recommend to this client putting some, some Kelpro Lime down, try to raise it about half a point, get it closer to the optimum range. Again, the benefits involved with having a good baseline pH uh, is incredible. Underneath this grass, in the root system, between the capacity and the exchange of nutrients back and forth, the fertilizers we're putting down, it all is directly related to pH. Uh, 